Father, where are we going? Oh. Father, can we? I... I want to go hunting. I will follow. We are with you, Atreus. What do we hunt? Here. Which way we headed, lad? In... the direction of deer. Do you wish to speak of what happened? I think I heard something. This way. He just needs space. Here. Tracks. They're leading that way. Atreus. Violence changes us. You are not weak to feel its effects. We're all feeling its effects. We're heading the right way. There's broken branches over there. Come on. I keep seeing it. The knife, rock, Sentry's face. Son. There it is. <laughs> Elbow up. Accuracy. Over speed. Why? And that was running. And so are we. I don't understand. An animal is wounded. It must stop the bleeding, or it will die. We have been wounded in this. This is a distraction. It's my fault. No. We should find Sindri. I have a pretty good idea where he might be. Lead. Is it okay if we take the sleds? I need to think about what I'm gonna say to him. Of course. Everywhere I look, 
I'm reminded of my mistakes. Our actions have consequences. To be reminded of them is not punishment. Feels like it. <clears throat> If I had just... Seen through a deception that fooled us all. Stopped an attack you could not predict. There is no if, Atreus. Your father's right. There are things even gods cannot control. It's Warner. It's Becky. We can take the sled when you're ready. Here's Temple. That's where we're headed. Mimir, is there a chance that we could bring Brock back? Sentry did it once. Maybe we could figure out a way to do it again. I'm afraid not, little brother. When a soul missing its full gear, its direction, like Brock, leaves its corporeal form. Well, it can't reach the Lake of Souls. He's not only dead, he's been denied an afterlife. There's nothing to bring back. It's really gone. Atreus, if there was anything we could do, I promise you, we'd be doing it. No. It was stupid of me to help in the first place. I miss when the lake was still water. I feel like I want to get on a boat and just sail away from here. From everything. You cannot sail away from your mistakes. It is impossible to forget them. I have tried. Aye. They'll follow you no matter where you go, little brother. If you are to sail, do it toward somewhere. The lift at the end of the bridge should still work. We can get up to the temple that way. Yes. What makes you so sure Sindri will be here? It's where he and Brock reunited. Reforging something that broke. He'll be here. Sindri, I... I'm so sorry. No. No, I don't want to hear it. You don't know what sorry means. We're not letting Odin get away with this. Would that be the Odin you invited into my home? We were all fooled. Oh. But some of us were bigger fools than others, aren't we? I gave you everything. My skills. My friendship. My home. My secrets. 
my treasures, and you just kept taking. And now what have I got? <laughs> Not even my family. You want sorry? This is what sorry looks like. I... What can we do? We. There is no we. There's only you. No matter what the cost. So what you can do... is get the fuck out of my sight! family too. I know I'll feel better when we brought Odin to justice. Justice? Justice is not what we seek. It is vengeance. Every path I walk leads back to vengeance. Maybe that's all we have left. We must return to Freya. <gasps> Just come to that. Yes. When we were back in Svartalfheim, I was looking for Tyr. This isn't what I wanted. This wasn't what I meant. Not if it meant losing Brock. We know Atreus. We know. We really took everything from Sindri. Don't take to heart what I've said in grief, Atreus. No matter how spot on they feel. I know we should go see Freya. But... I wouldn't mind staying here in Midgard. For a little while. Aye. A few last adventures to take our minds off the state of, well... Set that epic. aside for now. Come. Are we even sure Freya will still be at the house? Don't see why not. Odin's back door in was also his way out. Without the blasted raven apparently hiding in the broom closet, the house should be secure. And she will not turn away allies in her vengeance. Aye, it's all our vengeance now. And no more fake Tyr to twist our minds around. Oh, what a mockery he made of Tyr's desire for peace and mine. back. Are you with us? Mm. Good. It's time. Time for what, dare I ask? Time to unite the realms against Odin once and for all. Tyr tried to unite the realms. The real Tyr. Everyone loved him. 
and even he failed. Then we better not fail, or there will be no one left to try. This is Ragnarok. And Odin's already heard every blasted plan we have. Yes, we've lost the element of surprise. More than that, we have only one way to Asgard, and it's not so. Go. It means we enter from Tyr's temple, here. Asgard's wall is here. Odin's host of Einherjar will hold the space in between. Which means we need armies of our own. As many as will answer the call. Numbers Odin won't see coming. And that's just to reach the wall. To breach the wall, we'll need to find Surtur. Radatoskar was able to procure this. The three of us will go. I know just where to look. Mm. Splendid. Allies, then. Who do we think we can get? I'll venture to Helheim. Try to recruit the army of the dead. And I'll return to Alfheim to unite the elves. Just like that. Unite the elves after centuries of war. Well, they really like me in Alfheim. And you? To Valheim? Yes. To find Sigrun and muster the free Valkyries. Midgard has no army. Nor Niflheim, nor Jotunheim. That leaves only Svartalfheim. I'll go to Svartalfheim. Sindri? Are you sure? I said I'll go. So be it. Good luck to us all. to find the last fire giant. I almost envy everyone else's impossible mission. said you know where to look for Surtur. Yeah. I unlocked the secrets in the shrine when I was in Muspelheim with Thor. Thor? Don't worry. He didn't see me go in. That was not my worry. Now look. When we find Surtur, we'll have to convince him to combine with his wife, Sinmara. Combine? Yeah. When the two of them, uh, join, they'll create an enormous Asgard-destroying monster. Oh my. Apologies. I have some doubts regarding negotiations with Rosvelger in Helheim. My thinking is that she may be more amenable to speaking with a member of the, uh, deceased. Mimir, you're needed. Oh, death is a skill now. I suppose these two can survive a bit without me. Brother, if you wouldn't mind. Very well. Many thanks. We'll catch up with you later. Hey, I think I can see Surtur's forge in the distance. Surtur's wife? Where is she? Niflheim, I think. Heads up! There! That did it! I wonder if they saw their prophecy and decided to isolate themselves in their home realms to fight it. Understandable. Hopefully they'll understand why Ragnarok needs to happen. Whoa. An Yggdrasil seed to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? Look, over there. Oh! <laughs> 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 
Might be past this lava fall. You know this. A hunch. When I was here before, I got a pretty good feel for the layout. We need to be ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? Prophecy says he and Sinmara join. But who knows how they're gonna feel about it now? You would try to force these primordial beings into submission. Well, I don't know. You can't win this war without them, right? We gotta be close. I can hear the fort. Something ahead. Be ready. It's a phantom! <laughs> Take out the 
Bones must be headed. <laughs> Gotta be him. We will ask. Hello, Serger? Well, either it isn't him or he's ignoring us. Come on. Hello. We seek a fire giant. Go away. What just happened? Hey, that wasn't- We deal with these first. Oh! 
that is Serger. He's got a lot to answer for. As you said, we need him. I won't help you. Who are you? Who you seek? And what's left of him? Why won't you help us? I don't... want to. Elaborate. We'll die. Right. Because you've got so much to live for. Not me. Her. So what's the point of all this? You keep separate from Sinmara just so you can sit here and wait to die? At least if you joined with her, you'd be together again. We are together. Got her heart. She's got mine. It's not much, but it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. And Odin will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Well, he must die. It's true. But I won't sacrifice her any more than... You would him. Sorry. Come. Wait. Those blades. May I see them? fire in those. They are not of these lands. Shouldn't matter. <laughs> yeah. That could work. What could? Put those in here. And I'll become your monster. But I don't want her involved. At all. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. Sure this will work? What have I got to live for? Not here. Follow me. go spark of the world which is a place where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet where the first realms came into existence you won't be able to get through this huh Whoa. uh starter still, still me, me. Better than walking. What awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic. Primordial stuff. With that and your blades and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get it. Big. Smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Dunno. Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or, um... Future knew you. No one to attack Asgard. You got the horn. Right? Yeah. Then we're good. 
So, here it is. The spark of the world. This is beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Galoan. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he... ...knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that, too. This is it. What about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It had hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes... Loving someone is about choosing the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. I promise you'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, stabbing you with the blade's gonna be enough to create this new you? Simara's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those blades. If enough of me and the sparks fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here. Really is a hand right now. <laughs> 
gateway back from there. It worked. I can't believe it. We've got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. 
Hmm. Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Gro was right. Gro failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Ragnarok's strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. The earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. More of Odin's forces! We might finish the job if after he started! Behind you! Incoming! Behind you! in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. place is gonna fall apart if those keep happening. aren't going to stop attacking anytime soon. We need to get back. Be quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. Oh, 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 oh,
Shows up. The gate is just through this crack in the rocks when you're ready. Father, I know we're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. to a certain Vanya Nocti did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We have some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish up? This is it then, the beginning of the end. The end for Odin. And after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite. They have to. After everything they've been through. They have to. Don't they? so weird. We must have been to this part of the lake a hundred times, and I've never seen that building before. Aye. Strange, isn't it? Let's take a closer ah! look. Brother, about the oracles of your land. Would you say they manipulated events? Did they have an agenda? I do not doubt they held their own interests first. But in my experience, they could be easily fooled by their own prophecies. Would that be a specific experience, brother? Uh, once, I sought the Oracle for a means to break my bondage to Ares. But enough. It was the time. armies are probably gathered in their home realms, waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. 
Hildespini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... alive. Oh. Yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the Shield Maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Mimir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Excuse me. May I have a moment with Mimir? I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more, except perhaps a dance. Yet though I may have lost a step. <laughs> Do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I could never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight?
must quiet your mind. I can't. Then, I will tell you a story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Of course. Now, close your eyes. There was an old man who chopped wood for his village. Every evening he bore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy, and he grew weaker as time went. And one day, he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Getting us home? Does my request upset you? Death is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. We mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet? I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. The funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? <laughs> A 
in my land. We entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. In circumstance, yes. But not in purpose. <laughs> you prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me whenever that day comes. For you and for our son. <sighs> we will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. When you are gone, that part of me dies as well. See, you feel your absence. No. <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. To grieve deeply is to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. to battle with you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. 
I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the devil. That was dark. Let me get my fortune hammer. Thank you, Lunda. Ah, uh, yeah, big Saki. You can thank me after, uh, if uh, if we all come through the other. I will. Let me get my fortune hammer. Now those are some angry knives. Things are getting hotter. Spear look like a toothpick. Time to cleave some hands. Good luck out there, General. I believe in you. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. Prophecy did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered. Enough! No matter the cost. This ends... today. If going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too, and that's where I'll be. A big, fat smile on my face. For Brock.
themselves. Trying to shut out Ragni. Gotta stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Wait. I think they didn't have time. I know. Just wait. to do. You three, follow. Drea. Drea, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. 